Mass Burst versus Energy. And we have MIBR versus Astralis. It's a good day when there's two different teams playing at the exact same time. Uh, I finished the ethics reading, finally. Uh, I tried to last night, but my eyes were just closing. Couldn't help it. And, uh, yeah. So, I can, can now do this. Goodbye. I am not right-handed. And I never hold the camera with my left hand, so this is weird. Anyway, so ethics reading is done. Okay, I still have English reading to do, so I have comp sci reading to do, and I have a blog post for English as well. Um, laundry is almost done. That's the wonderful dryer that you can hear much more than my voice. And, uh, yeah, so I'm getting it done. Just enjoying some CS too. Living large. I got a book about AI and how it plays into political factors and stuff. That's at my grandparents' house, so I'm gonna head over there today. And, um, yeah, I don't know what time I'm gonna do that. Just need to watch these matches more than anything else. Very important. I will check back in later. Back from my grandparents' house, and I've done a lot of stuff today. I got my English reading done, along with some laundry. A lot of laundry. All the laundry that I could possibly fit in my laundry basket. And trust me, if you try hard enough, this laundry basket can fit a lot of clothes in it. And this cat is still hiding under the bed, no matter what I do. Megan, come here. Come here. No reaction. She might hate me. I need to figure out what I need to do next. Couple options. Chapter 14. Blog posts and vlog. Can't do the vlog though because I'm recording the vlog right now. Therefore, I will begin working on the blog post. Let's see if I can get it done. Boom! It is up. Honestly, not sure if I did that right, but it's up. I mean, it's not like that big of a deal. I did it, which is what matters most. I mean, I'm the first one to do it, so I don't really know if I did it right. I don't know where I got this energy from. It's all a persona. Boom. Goodbye. I don't know what I'm gonna do now. I'm thinking, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, <laughs> I'm going to do my comp sci project and get it working. Like, maybe not fully, but like, the stuff that I've implemented so far, get that working and fleshed out, and um, yeah, like, I, I think that's, that's a good idea. Cause that's how my English essay, everything's due next week, right? But one, it's always just good to get ahead, might as well. Two, I have homecoming next weekend, so time is going to be minimal, at least on Saturday. Like, Saturday is not a day that I have time to do homework and stuff. So, I really need to make sure that I just get everything done while I can. And I'm trying to get everything done tonight as much as possible. So that way, for most of tomorrow, I can play CS and just get in the zone, auto zone. But I do have to go to King Supers, even though I went to Walmart earlier, to go pick up cat food. Um, I do have some vouchers for free cat food, but I don't know where the nearest PetSmart is, and it's not close as far as I know. Anyways, King Supers are really close. Going to get some cat food, and then going to get some Chick-fil-A as well, um, just so that way I have food for the rest of the night. Don't have to worry about that. Yeah, I'm glad. I think I'm just do comp sci projects, read a little, keep on coding and integrate it in, and then tomorrow I can work on my English essay and get that started, at least. Lots of stuff to do. I also need to shave at some point. I feel like I look like a homeless person. 10 o'clock. <laughs> sort of lost track of time. <laughs> I've just been coding for two hours. Um, it's really complicating how to do this one thing. Um, and eventually, like just now, I figured out how to do it and make it really simple and easy. The green part is stuff that I commented out and this is what I was doing before and it's basically a copy of this function. But all I needed was do this. Just write this one line instead of these three. And same thing down here as well. Um, I just had to do that same file, that same function again. Me and overcomplicating things, name a more iconic duo. So yeah, I'm just working through this project. I'm really glad because like, I'm just enjoying the coding process. I don't have to stress out about like, what is going wrong? Am I gonna be able to fix this in time? You know, like, it feels good just having the time and definitely like, there's no stress on my end. I have a week to do this. It's not like it's due tonight or even tomorrow night. So, very glad I'm getting ahead of all my work. So, I was struggling for a while. It's 12.15. <laughs> I'm totally losing track of time, but I'm getting deep into this code, and 
I finally got it working to the point where it's reading the file. I had to change up the format a little, but um, it's working perfectly now, and that's freaking awesome, man. Because that was a struggle. But now that I have that working, I think I just have some simpler tasks to do. I mean, you like the first project that we had, I mean, this continuation of the first project, but the first project, the thing that I got caught up on was file IO and like reading and writing to it and it was just killing me. So now that that's out of the way, I honestly feel like I'm pretty much in the clear. I don't think that there's going to be too much more to this project because we're overloading some other operators, but in like don't really use them yet it's, and they're not as complicated as file io i definitely think like file io is one of the most complicated things you can do especially in like c plus plus like it's such a low level language that file io is not an easy thing it's cool because these two lines of code make up for code that was like 50 lines long now that code is in each class but that's okay. That's to be expected. That's the class's functionality. It's just better not to have that in the main app. So it's really cool. I'm really happy that I'm done with that. I'm just going to keep on working on it. I mean, I'm getting a little bit tired, but I'm enjoying it. There's such a difference between like last weekend, I think it was when I had the first project due and I was just like struggling to get it done and stressing out. And it wasn't until like literally 1130 at night that I submitted it. This time I'm just like, you know, running some bugs, but it's not stressful. It's not like it's all in the line, if I can figure it out or not. Because when you're debugging and like on a strict deadline, that's horrible. That just sucks. So, I'm having a lot of fun. I'm gonna get back to it. Two o'clock in the morning now. <laughs> Finally starting to get tired, which is good. I, I haven't been tired all night. Anyways, um, it's really cool. Got really far in the comp side project. Ugh. My eyes, like, now are, like, close yourself. Uh, I got really far in the comp side project. I got a file I.O. working tonight. I also got user input working, so it's using the new things that I just made. So that's fully working. Um, all of my old remove uh, functionality is still working perfectly fine. So now it's just adding a few more operators, and that's it. So I say maybe two two to three hours left on this project was awesome that's not that much at all so and I, I i do some of the updating and coding inside or like during our comp site classes so i'll probably just not work on this at all tomorrow it's awesome i got really far in this i will see you tomorrow even though that's today huh i'm gonna wake up at eight so six hours of sleep so basically i have the chapter for comp sci to read english essay to start on and then chapter four for comp sci as well this was a lot better of a day i wish i could record my coding process and stuff but i'll go into the features i added later on in the week <laughs>